Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of the Unreal Cousins Now. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make teleporters in Unreal Engine, which is pretty cool. Uh, so, yeah, I'll just call this teleport. And, yeah, we'll get started. I'm going to make teleporters and make it really, really cool. So, yeah. It depends on how you want to set up your teleporters. So under basic, you see box trigger. You can set these to be teleporters if you want to just do something in your level. And um, what I'm also going to do is show you how to do that as well as I'm going to make a, a blueprint and I'm going to make an actor. And it's going to, when you step on this little box, it'll also teleport you. So. Uh, yeah, we're making an actor and we're calling a teleporter. Very cool. And so I'll start out with just showing you how to do the, this box trigger thing. So let's make it so that when I step on this, it teleports me. And I mean, teleporting is basically just a function. So you can basically teleport whenever you want. But uh, at the end of this video, I'm going to make a very cool teleporting thing. So that's nice. Let's see. You go blueprints, open level blueprint, and then you get this. Mine looks kind of weird, I don't know. Uh, so we're going to do on actor begin overlap. Yeah, you have to be selecting the actual trigger while you open this, or else that won't really know what you're doing. But anyways, just say teleport. And um, basically... All, you can basically have your character teleport whenever you want. All you need is just this teleport block. That's really all it is. You can tell it to teleport where to teleport it to, and you can make this a variable if you wanted to. For the target, we're going to get player character. And uh, there's something else we can do. We can make a point, a target point, right? And uh, let's just let's just make it so that it teleports to where this target point is. You know, that's that's nice. So let's just you just drag it in from here. I think yeah. Type in get actor location just like that, and then just put it here. All right, we'll, 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 we'll say that that's good for now. And we'll just put this point uh, right there. That way the player will teleport right there. Oh, yeah, works, as you can see. Very nice, very nice. We like to see it. Um, so, yeah, now if I walk right here onto that trigger, I teleport right there. Very cool. Now, um, I'm going to make an actor that basically does the same thing just because yeah, that's probably what you would want to do anyways. Oh, I already made it, right. So, let's just uh, make a box, right? A cube, yeah. We'll change the collisions down here. So that it overlaps all dynamics, so, like, people can walk into it, so that it can, like, you know, people can walk into it and get teleported. Right, all right. And then, here we go. Let's, uh, let's open the event graph. And uh, right here, it's already here. And then we just do teleport. And then we just do get player character. Nice, nice. All right, let's let's see let's see how this works. Oh yeah, we also wanted to teleport to somewhere. Let's just say we'll go to where this is. I'll just copy these. All right, now that I have values that actually work, if I walk onto this, I'll just be teleported right there. So yeah, very, very cool, as you can tell. All right, now I'm going to make something using this, and uh, I'll show you when I'm done. And it is going to be very cool, okay? Yeah.
All right, yeah, it's done. It's not really that cool, but I, I was hoping it would be cooler, but you know, it's fine. Basically, it just keeps teleporting the character, and you know, you just fall, and yeah. It's basically just a loop, like it teleports, and you fall, and then you just keep going, and basically, that's what this is. So, yeah, very cool, but yeah, that's all.